Well, hello, folks. Auction day again. So let's get to the auction at Swaffham. Eight o'clock Saturday morning. We'll have a look at what's going on. Oh, oh, I can see the stuff. It's peeking at me from behind the cars here. There we go. Let's have a look at what's going on. Oh. So we've had two very wet days and today it's all right. Oh my God, there isn't a lot of stuff on the auction today, look. Look at this, there's nothing on the indoor stuff. Oh my word. But what have we got? There we go, we're going to start with Mark Welder. There we are. She got some rods with it, she got the mask, the leads. There we go, here we are. Seed spreader. Here we have, look at this for a King Dick generator. Ro generator, rotivator. Look at that, she's got the she got the powered wheels as well. She got the five horse brakes and stratton. There you go. Oh now this is nice. Is this a mailbox? That is a very bloody heavy one. That ain't a tin one, she's a cast iron one. That would go lovely on the new house. Need to put a lock in it. But Mrs. Man Cave, a whole batch of garden gnomes, look. Yeah, look, a whole box of garden gnomes. Do you want some gnomes? Here we have some clocks. Whatever this menagerie is here. There we go. We've got a hydrometer, a clock. And what looks like a thermometer. Yeah, a whole box of sundries. We have some sockets, orange flashing light. There's some lightweight jump leads in there. Some, yeah, some sockets. There's a saw. There's a power trimmer. And what have we got in the little bag? A skill saw. Hmm. What's this? Is this just a box? It is just a box. Nice heavy wooden one, but a box never the still. We have a bench. This is all exciting stuff, isn't it? We have a jerry cans, and petrol cans, a box of what look like materials, yeah, perfect for your arts and crafts, people. A sovereign lawnmower. That's a runner. A box full of bicycle bits. There you go. Shimano gears, twist grips, two sets of handlebars, and there's two bike wheels and a bike frame with the wheel out and all. What's that a rock? There you go. Might be noteworthy mention here that I'm using a brand new camera today. This will be the first video I've done with a new camera. <sighs> look what I spot. A Briggs 5 horsepower. But look, I spot a little slanty billiards. And a couple of old cranking handles. Oh, why does this have to be on here? <clears throat> does the little billiard spin? <laughs> It does. Oh, it does spin with zero compression. The top's been left off the air cleaner and there's some sort of crud in there. Can I be trucked up with that? Mm. We'll see what's on the rest of the auction. What we got here? There's a little wooden clamp. Of course, that's heavier than it looks. Fuck me, that is heavier than it looks. I think that's metal. Another wooden box. So yes, I'm using a new camera. Ooh, an old toolbox, look. I'm using a new camera, which is part of my new phone. I've now gone fully technical. I've got a S24 Ultra. There you go, because that's meant to have one of the best cameras on the market. So we'll see. Let me know if the video quality is better than normal. Mm. Some pots and pans. A coal bunker. 
some plumbing fittings, some flash banding. We have some paint. Yeah, Dulux weather shield. A toilet system. Some more paint, which is some crown mat. Uh, we have some lights. Whatever these are. Well, this is a rum box of stuff, in it? They look like what's a generating or a yeah, that looked like some form of generating unit in with a ceiling light and an oil lamp. Only on swap. Now then, what was it Brian Adams said? I got my first real six string in 69. There we go. So if anybody wants 1969. Made out of inch thick timber. I'm guessing this was some sort of display in a shop at some point, I'm guessing. 1969 look some more Jay's fluid that seems to be here every week a little compressor a muffkin could come in handy for something yeah what's the fitting on it oh what's the fitting that's off a generator I think there we go yeah. oh we have a NASA Haynes manual for the Apollo spacecraft. Well, there you go. That, so if you've got an Apollo 11 at home, you can now work on it. There you go. We've got an Apollo 11. You can now work on your Apollo 11. How interesting is this look? It even teaches you how to fly the damn thing. Now, oh, they even teach you the Saturn 1 rocket as well. There we are. Right. Two more boys. Some blinds, wicker baskets, and there you go, boxes of tools, well we got nothing in that one, spanners, screwdrivers, uh, the mother of all Allen keys, no she's a good one, there's a couple of rails of sockets, look at that bad boy, a couple of rails of sockets, some more sockets, some tools, oh, a box of, a bucket of screws, and a bag of nails and screws. I've said it before, you can't have too many nails and screws. There's a speed brace with some more sockets, wine bottle carrier, CD rack, welcome to 2006, ah, a torque wrench. Which has been backed up, so someone stored it correctly. I think we've got another torque. We've got an old school one here. Look, I've got one of these. Our bloody good old tool. And another torque wrench with the end out. So three torque wrenches. A bucket. And there's a hole in my bucket. Dear Liza, dear Liza. There is a hole in my bucket. Some enamel bacon tins. There we go. A manamel bread tin. Here we have a Sealy toolbox with some files. You know, you need some files, but I don't know if I want to buy a whole toolbox. So that's all there is in there. Not sure I want to buy a whole toolbox just for files. A box of cups, saucers, and whatever that thing is fruit bowl. An old aluminium jelly mould look. Yeah, my granny used to have a load of aluminium jelly moulds. Oh, I think this can, I, you know, I think this is someone's grandmother's house. Look at the oranges we've got in here. Oh yeah, this is definitely from somebody of an elderly-ish age. Oh yes, look at the little trinkets in the saucepan. Definitely. Here we have another box with some bits, including whatever this is, a minion in it, a game of Monopoly, Waddington's, what's in the mystery bag, is this a camcorder or something? What is in here? Oh yeah, there's camera and lead, no, it's just the leads really, look, just some power supplies. Now there's nothing in the other side, that's too light. That side's empty. And a box with 
bathroom taps. One of them racks that go across the bath or you put your sponge and soup in. Three tier cooling rack. Yeah. And I think that's it. What have we got here? Here we have that little pump. That looked like a little pump of some sort and then an immersion or a water pump. But I think this is some sort of either air blower or pump. Really fast gas pump I don't know what it is and then a trailer with two old bikes in it and someone's just bought a singing song machine and a basket all right we'll give it a minute so I think that gentleman's now going to get his stuff out of his van so we better have a look see if anything else gets on it so we got as far as the trailer there's also now just these bits been dri dripped off, dripped off, dropped off. We have fishing rods, some terracotta pots, and a Land Rover Discovery 3 grill. Could be right, really don't know. Good morning, Helen. <laughs> She's camera shy, isn't she? Right, there we are. Here is today's auction. We will have a look, and I'll possibly be back later. But I do have updates on the groundwork at home, so I really need to possibly be home later to be with the groundsman because he's doing more leveling out and putting hard core down today. So I might not get back for this because, to be honest with you, there's nothing I really want and I don't need another bilious engine. So wait till the end, I might come back, but if I don't, this is going to be it. I will say cheerio, thank you very much for watching this video, like and subscribe to the channel. Every time you click that little thumbs up, that little like, really, really helps the channel. The same if you subscribe, it's totally free, costs you nothing, but it just tells YouTube, but uh, yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing some more videos from this bloke with the silly hat. But there you go. Right, I'm going to go. I will see you guys next time. And the next video will probably either be on, well, seeing that lot sold, or it'll be on the groundwork we haven't done. We have had 36 tonnes of crushed concrete delivered. 40 mil, but it ranges between sort of 60 mil and powder. But there you go, we'll see, aren't we? Yes, so that's been, that's been delivered, two big heaps, and the man with the mini digger is there again today. And he's got a leveler off for us, so we've got a nice garden. So watch out for that video. All right. I've got to get going. I've remembered where I put my car this morning, which is over here. And there we go. All right. See you next time, guys. Ah.